As a correspondent and anchor, I chased every assignment with the same passion, to tell a story that makes a difference. CNN's Mark Watts from Los Angeles. Mark? And that now forms the basis of my instruction at Marked Academy. To teach the broadcaster to present and communicate the story in a way that makes an impact. The verbal art of communicating powerfully. Without Mark, I wouldn't be here right now. I'd, I'd have a simple job on TV. I wouldn't be hosting a show in New York. I wouldn't be working for two different networks. I evaluate the power, the depth, the punch, and everything that you do to have that content explode from your mouth. Just what if you were bold all the time? <laughs> Do you see how badass you would be? Some closing thoughts on O.J. Simpson and the completion of jury selection. I think his mood speaks for everybody involved in this case. One of relief. All right, Sarah. This is why people speak quickly on television. Because you already know what you're going to say next. So you're ahead of yourself. It's how vociferously you argue your point. I teach the formula to improve. I embed the app in the talent's brain. <laughs> My largest takeaway is that there are no two ways to be your best self as a broadcast personality. There are 12 different ways. Remember, I told you how you're evaluated. By what you say, how you say it, what you look like when you're saying it. Before I met him, I didn't know what not to do. I mean bold in the sense of pushing your audience and pushing yourself. He really challenged me to implement all those factors into my work every day and, and honestly without him I wouldn't be able to advance as much as I could. This is the app, right? Verbally be bold. He's helped me become the analyst I am and what's even more exciting is I'm still in the beginning stages of my career.